John 10, 14. Ego sum pastor bonus, et cognosco meas, et cognoscunt me mei. I am the good shepherd, and I know my sheep, and my sheep know me. Now here we have a pretty straightforward verse. We only have three small clauses. We have subject, copula, predicate nominative. We have a verb with a built-in subject, as is the natural state of Latin verbs with its objects, and an explicit subject, verb, and object. The only thing that really seems to stand out grammatically is why we have meas, accusative plural, feminine, and mei, nominative plural, also feminine. The best way to read this is probably as os meas and os mei. This gives us cause for the feminine gender as os is a feminine noun and plural. And as we have seen, the translator is ready to mimic the Greek whenever he can. So when he sees tama, the simple pronoun with the article standing in place of the noun it's referring to, as pronouns are exactly designed to do, he simply uses meas and mei to represent os in both positions. It may seem a little stilted when we look at it in Latin, just because it's not the most natural, but the Greek that it is representing is perfectly natural. Recognizing this, when Erasmus comes to this text, he actually does translate it in his version as os meas, but notably not as os mei, because what Erasmus had access to was a different textual tradition that does not read cognoscunt me mei, because when he was trying to represent the Greek tradition in a new Latin translation, uh, the Greek tradition of the text that he had displayed a passive form of the verb gignoskin, the text actually read gignoskomai tripatonamon, as seen below. But Jerome had a different reading that read like this. Now, textual history is very messy. It is not as simple as the text that Erasmus has was better, or the text that Jerome had was better as a representation of the Greek text. But in this case, it does seem that Jerome had the better reading. But all that to say that Erasmus's reading does look a little bit different in the third clause, looking like this, Gognoskora meis. So he has os explicitly said in the first clause, and then ameis dropping the os in the third clause, thinking that the representation of just the pronoun was enough to express what was meant.